My name's Andy Ng. I'm uh, from Alexandria, Virginia. I practice at the Anderson Clinic and I work at Mount Vernon Hospital. I specialize in treating patients with arthritis and that includes non-surgical treatment and surgical treatment of arthritis and osteoarthritis. So talking about arthritis and osteoarthritis and is there really a difference between them? There, there probably isn't a difference. Arthritis is more of a general condition that can affect any joint. It basically makes the joint stiff and painful. So many, many people have uh, arthritis. Osteoarthritis is typically diagnosed once you've seen the doctor, been examined, and had an x-ray. And then you, we add the x-ray findings. Uh, osteoarthritis often ne uh, leads to, to treatments. Uh, generalized uh, arthritis or a sore joint sometimes just needs rest and exercise. Osteoarthritis, how do we diagnose or figure out whether someone has osteoarthritis is really just a matter of talking to the patient first, examining the patient, and then in the end getting an x-ray. And so when what we see on the x-ray matches what the patient tells us and what we can see on the exam, then we know they have osteoarthritis. And that's about 80% of the patients that ends up needing a joint replacement. So the question is, how do you know when you need a joint replacement? I, I think probably it's better to think, when do you need to be treated for your osteoarthritis? Because the joint replacement is the final treatment. Earlier treatments can be as simple as changing your lifestyle, taking medications, sometimes getting an injection, and all of those things lead up to the decision to have a joint replacement. So how do you decide when to have a joint replacement? Well, perhaps you've already been treated for arthritis with medications and you've altered your lifestyle. I tell people when they notice their joint every day, when they have trouble sleeping at night and they're awakened, when they can't stand uh, at a social event for 30 minutes or an hour, uh, when they can't go for an evening walk or walk their pets. Uh, you know, if you can't walk a couple of blocks, your life is severely limited and you should be thinking about a joint replacement.